Hi everyone, it's Cindy Red Deer. Welcome to a new series. Oh, I don't think it was really a series, but I am going to play. This is a 1.3 world I created after the 1.3 update came out. It is, um, I haven't played a lot on it. So uh, recently I was on here and I found a really cool place that I want to move my house. This is my original house that I built. As you can see, it's a log cabin. <laughs> so all my logs are sideways. And I built this cool stairway down so that I could uh, go across the island and mine. And a little bridge. And right down in here, I was over on this island and heard a cave noise. So I had to come over and dig around. And there is a cave down here. And, but, I found this really cool ravine when I went exploring, and I want to move and live there. So, I'm in the process of doing that. I can't remember where my spawn point is for this particular world. Looks like I got a little... My garden, I just barely got it started. <laughs> So, um, I think I'll leave it growing and then I can always run back and harvest from it. I got it nicely fenced in. But I think there's a few things I want to take whoops, from here with me, including my bed. Okay. Oh, I have a bed. Good, good. Looks like I have the most important stuff. Uh, maybe I should take my furnace with me. Not that it's going to be that hard to get cobble where I'm going, but so there's a couple things in here for if... Ooh. <laughs> How do I manage to do that every time? Okay, maybe I'll just give you a little bit more of a tour. Because over here I made myself a pool. Which is going to stay here. The other th reason I'm moving is there's nothing but sheep here. There's no cows, no chickens. Go for a swim. Okay, we'll have a nap first before we run over to the other side of... The, well, I don't think it's on the other side. It has been a while since I played because I was playing the dropper for the longest time <laughs> and I hadn't played a lot of other games while well, I finished that. Ah, nap. Alright, let's head across. Let's get our sword out. Take some seeds with us. Okay, I do have some food. That's always good. Let's follow the torches. This is very grassy in here. As I go, where's the next torch? There it is. Ma so many sheep. And nothing else. See, it's hard to see the torches. There's so much grass. This is quite a hilly world as I go. Which way is the quickest way up? Okay, there we go. That's a big tree over there. So many sheep. I'd count them, but I'm really tired and I might fall asleep. Arr, arr, arr. <laughs> hey, Dale. Excuse me. <laughs> Trying to make sure I don't fall in it. I've done enough falling lately. I really don't want to do any more. Excuse me. 
Anybody been c keeping track of the sheep? Whee! Uh oh. I need to check something. Ah. <laughs> I'm like, why is my food not going down? That would be why. Just stop every once in a while and really look. Okay, where's my next torch? There it is. It just blends in with the grass. I should have put it all up on um, blocks. <laughs> and now my food's going down. It seemed like it was lasting a long time. Oop, there's the next one. Do, 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 do. Go for a swim across the swamp, I think. But, nope. <laughs> I think what I'm looking for is right here. The reason that I'm moving closer. Is this. <laughs> I have to be really careful or I'll end up killing myself falling into this thing. Now that doesn't that look like fun to explore? So that's why we're moving house. Because we're gonna be exploring this big cave. Hmm. I didn't explore this area too much. Before I came over, I saw the ravine and went, I need to come here. Oh, this would be good temporary shelter. Look, it's on this side of the island. Ooh, lots of things to explore. So, yeah, this is what we're going to explore for a while. And I can't wait. And we should probably make a house. Which I'm going to put right over here. But I'm going to fill this hole. Because guaranteed, I will fall into it. Hello, sheep. Hmm. Trying to decide if I want to build my house inside this tree like I did at my other. How much wood do I have? 15. I think I need to cut some wood. And I need to dig a little bit. I should plant some close to water. I have a bucket. So where should I put my garden? What do you want, sheep? Holy Toledo. It's a good thing I have some chicken. Which I found the last time I came through here. Because I really didn't have any food. And part of that was because... Excuse me. I uh, was playing on Peaceful when I first started this. <laughs> It's only fairly recently that I started um, really playing on easy. Let's get a uh, water source going here. Where's my bucket? There we go. Always nice to have a good water source. and then build your garden around it. Okay, I don't think I have too many seeds so I shouldn't get too carried away. But if we can get the garden start... Oh! <laughs> that is not seed. I should probably collect some more. There's a ton of grass around here. Um, 
That's a pretty good return rate on seeds. The really bright stuff seems to give you more seeds than this swamp grass. <laughs> I think that's what you would call it. I need to cut some trees down. Alright. That gives us four more. Oh, five more. I don't like all this grass anyway. I don't like it cluttered. Alright. Oops. Alright, let's plant a few more seeds. What are you looking at, sheep? Walk on my lawn, or my grass. All right. All right, we have some time left. Need to cut some trees down. Let's get this one. I actually find cutting trees down quite relaxing. Never fails. Let's get another one. Because we'll probably just do a dirt floor for the first night. Look at there's mushrooms around. Anybody see any red ones? I'll get some saplings and replant these trees. Maybe a little further away from my house. Alright. There's some saplings already. Nice if some apples would fall. It's raining saplings. All right, let's make some planks. And we will start house. We'll refine it. This is just a quickie, a quickie house to, uh, I'm not even counting blocks. Do I have glass in my inventory? I do. So I don't have to be completely windowless. <laughs> Forget to talk. See, the tree can be our window. Or our roof, sorry. Focusing on the fact that I'm running out of time. Oh, fudge. Well, if we do this right, let's put my bed down. And we'll quickly sleep and hopefully no monsters come in. <laughs> I have a big open wall. Sleeping sort of under the stars. All right. I'm a big fan of lots of windows. to can't remember how to do oh I need a workbench which I don't have that will make it from this dark wood all right where do we want here's the bed the door is right here
So let's put workbench. Oh, I need to make a chest too right away. The stove at the foot of my bed, keep my feet warm. Let's make a door out of the dark wood. Fudge. <laughs> Put it in the wrong spot. There we go. Oh, look at all the saplings and apples. Yummy. Cool. I like apples. And I'm not hungry yet. But what do you think? Put in a couple more windows, but I and I probably a glass roof. Look, I got sand right here handy. Yes. I like the swampy look. Stick some sand so we can get some uh, some of it burning. Shovel, shovel, shovel. Let's use this one up. Can I have red mushrooms in my inventory? Oh, fudge. We'll fix that with some dirt. Don't want any running water. Okay, let's get some glass cooking. Ugh. I'll have to expand my house when I start, um, if I want to do an enchantment. Uh, table and room, so I'll probably build a library. Let's just throw some coal in there. See, got my leather. Because I was over here and I killed a couple cows. Which <laughs> I'm probably going to have to farm cows. But I needed some steak and some chicken. Because I had no food whatsoever. Oh, I should put these sugar canes. I should plant those. Got some wheat. So I can breed the animals. And I should make a chest. To put some of this stuff in. Can you use different colored wood now? When you're making something? Yes! Should we do two? No. We'll just do one for now. Take out all this floor. Eventually. Put those in there for now. Feathers. Let's put the mushrooms, let's put the food all over here. Apples. My lapis azula. Zazula. Lapis. Uh, oh, I don't want that in there. I want that in there. Stack these. Oh, five spares. Put that in there. I need to get some water from my bucket so I can carry my bucket around with me. And I make a glass pane. Is it three across? Or is it six? It must be six. It must be six. Oh, that didn't take very long, did it? Guess we'll find out. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. There we go. So we can put, oops, put it in the appropriate spot so we can actually get, get it. Now, let's take this out. I usually have two exits, which I will probably add to this house. Uh, I need some square blocks for my roof. Because I don't think you can use glass panes for that. But what you will do, we'll take our a layer of leaves. And 
and then you put glass block. What do you think? So we'll do that all the way around for the roof. So we'll have a glass roof, wooden house. I'll take the floor out. I might go back and get a bunch of sheep and put carpet in. Because I like my colored floor. I do like my colored floor. I should look at the front of it. Oh, you can see the glass block in there. Hmm, I might have to, oops, get some shears and I'm going to cut some leaves and put them back on there. That is just not good enough. Just not good enough. So this is my 1.3 world. You will come with me while I explore um, this huge ravine. I hope it's as big as it is. I haven't really gone into it. I've just looked at it from the top. So until next time, we'll see you.